All right, I'm gonna show you here how to take off your sliding screen door uh, using a Phillips screwdriver if needed, and anything flat, uh, even a, a butter knife would work. This is just a putty knife. Uh, this flat piece is gonna go at the bottom uh, underneath the door. So your first step is just to try and see if you can lift up the door. This door is pretty loose, which is actually what you want it to be. Um, it allows the butter knife to get up and under here. So you're lifting up the weight off of the door. Now you're exposing the wheels if you want to zoom in here just a little bit. Um, you can see the wheels and you can see now when I put the butter knife underneath there, it actually pulls that out of the channel. It's just the reverse when you're going back to install it. So you're trying to get it onto that channel there uh, with the wheels. So in the event that you can't do that, there's adjusting screws in the side. You want to just pull around the side over here. Uh, if it won't go up any farther, these adjusting screws have been screwed down. So you'll put your screwdriver in here and just give it a, a few turns until that will move up. You want the metal to touch the top pretty much. Um, but you don't want to really adjust, touch the adjusting screws if you don't have to. That's why you just try it first. It's in an adjusted mode so that it's going to slide and close well for you. Uh, once you're able to get that adjustment out, oh, there's also screws in the bottom. This says a FYI in case those ones are pushed down. Same thing in the side. Turn it a few times and that will uh, lower the screen frame down, allowing the wheel to get pulled up. So you pull the one off. The second one off and I'm putting, pushing my weight up so the door's not going to fall off. And then you just pull the door off like so. And then we all have a tag for you and put that tag around the door independently. And then you'll also have a tag for your window screens to put that around there as well.